Now, one of the issues with the Bricks mobile menu is how we have this close icon kind of overlapping onto the words over here, the menu items. Bricks are going to be bringing out a mobile menu builder in the very near future, which will probably address this and give you much more functionality in what you do. But if right now you're using it, and you've got your items over here, this is probably going to be a little bit problematic. Now, you could also say, well, it's not really problematic because all you've got to do is go over to your style, go over to your typography, make sure it is left aligned. You'll see it in a moment when I bring it back again. Let's go back to there, go back to content and mobile menu. So now it is left aligned. Then what we're going to do is go over to the horizontal for the mobile menu down here and move it over. And at this point, you go, well, what's the problem? But at the moment, it is very close to the top. What, regardless of whether I've got it on the left side or the right side or whatever, obviously, when it's over here, the X is now on top of it. And you could also, again, say, well, again, what's your problem? Just go over here and start messing around with your toggle button or your close button. So you might say, here you go, let's put it in down here, maybe, or um, more to the top. Or rearrange it. But the point I'm making is what if I don't want this to be right near the top? I want this to be about 60 pixels away from the top. How do I do that? Well, if you mess around with any option here, that's for the toggle or the close buttons, that's not going to do anything. If I go over here for the sub menu, well, that's the sub menu. That again does not touch anything here. Look, if I go in and put in 50, it's not going to do anything. If I go here now for the top level, watch what happens when I put in 100. It not only does it move it down, it also creates this inner spacing. Well, that's rubbish. I don't want that either. But there is a really simple, great way to do this. I want to say thanks to Sinan from our live chat who pointed the code out for this. What you want to do is go to your nav menu and the code will be in the description. Go to your style. Go to the CSS tab. So you're on the nav menu. You're on the style. You go to CSS. You scroll down and down here you put in the code. Now. That code basically is saying mobile menu, margin top 60 pixel. Please do make sure, you make sure you are in the mobile portrait or the mobile landscape. Okay, don't stick this in the desktop. Make sure you do it in the mobile one. Now, I want to give you a word of warning, though. A couple of times this has been put in and it disappears. So if that ever happens, please put it in a secondary location as well. Let me just save this for a moment. Let me hit the Bricks logo to open up WordPress. If you go over to Bricks, go to Settings and go to Custom Code, you can also drop that in over here as well. So just bear that in mind, okay? You might want to do that or you might even want to go to Fee Appearance, Customize down here, go to Additional CSS and drop the code over here as well. Okay, I'll let you decide on that. So after popping in that code into the nav menu CSS, if we now go back over to our content and go to mobile menu, can you now see we have 60 pixel? It's moved it down and it has not added in any extra inner spacing in a way with padding. So if this menu was now right aligned and over here, it would be under the X. So this is another way of how you can stylize it a little bit better rather than being restricted into it being rooted up to the top. Hey, I'm Imran Web Squad, and I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow. I'll see you. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win your life. Have no shame, there's no time. Feel the pain, let the grind. I could change in my mind. Pick a lane, commit and climb. The only way to win it life. I never miss that fact. Taking big swings, bitch, hand me the bag.